And welcome everybody here on Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Stony Shivana. We're going to be playing some Bannerman Demacia midrange with Stony Suppressor, making all spells cost one more, and um, Shivana and some dragons at the top end. So for our dragons in here, we're going to have three Shivanas, we're going to have three Screeching Dragons, two Eclipse Dragon, our only Targon card that we're going to try out. Cause this this is a really, really good quality dragon with both the Daybreak and the Nightfall. Especially the Nightfall, though. The Daybreak works great when you're going up to Aurelian Soul, which we aren't doing, so the Nightfall will get us extra card advantage. Um, but then we'll also have some other dragon payoffs in here. We're going to have two Dragon Guard Lieutenants to be a 2-mana 3-2 Challenger and two Egghead Researchers that will be able to summon some random dragon followers for us. So yeah, we're going to just try to curve out with all of these units. Um, hopefully have the Stony Suppressor slow down our opponent. I, I really like Stony Suppressor along with Bannerman because as a 1-3, one 1-3s one are pretty easy to ignore in combat. And I think that you need to make this body bigger than just a 1-3 to, to really make this card more useful. And that's what Bannerman can do, giving it, uh, you know, at least making it a 2-4 and then you know maybe another Bannerman a 3-5 and, and so on. Um, so that's what our deck's about. We're going to try out some sharp sights in here. Uh, so we, we do have, we still have, you know, 10 spells. So 25% of our deck is spells. Um, and so instead of playing like a, a Scythria, like another one drop, I, I think that the sharp sight could be important in a lot of things. Helps us block elusives, helps some of these other things stay alive. Great with challengers. We're going to have um, a few sharp sights in repost for some pump spells and protection. And then other removal with three single combat and concerted strike. So those are our ten spells. All right, but let's give it a try. So we're gonna play some Stony Shivana over in ranked. I'm really not sure if like Sharp Sight or Pale Cascade is supposed to be the card for this deck. I like Pale Cascade more, and I like the card draw part of Pale Cascade, especially in a deck like this that that doesn't really have very much else to draw cards. But then again, Pale Cascade is a target on cards, so that makes that worse for Bannerman. So we never ever want to miss on Bannerman, so we're going to play the Sharp Sights instead. And <laughs> Trundle is pretty nuts. Alright, Lee Sin Zed. Hmm. We'll keep Lieutenant Protege. We got our Dragon for our Lieutenant. Perfect. All right, love the Bannerman. Just fills our curve, two through five. Never again will we fall to dragon Actually, you know what? I should have just played Stony Suppressor. I should have played Stony Suppressor because I think my, I think what I'm gonna do is play Protege to challenge here. Alright, so next turn I could go Suppressor, Egghead Researcher. Obviously they could play the gem on the 4-2, or on the 3-2 to keep it from dying. Oh, Zenith. Zenith Blade. Alright. Don't think I'm going to Concerted Strike that thing. I want to play 2-2 two, two drops here and make my Bannerman better. Why would they pass? My shield is yours. All right, so I think they're planning on hush. Here they come. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're planning on hush. But still, hush means we trade two mana for two mana, trade one card for one card, and we're dealing damage to this goat. Making this go harder to, or like easier to kill. And now we could have Garen. My heart and sword for Demacia. Yeah, so <laughs> Stony Suppressor not only makes their spells cost one more, but also their Lee Sin costs one more. So their Lee Sin costs five now. Master See? yourself. Cost five Master now. Your enemy. 
You call this a fight? Hardly fair. Yeah, I guess I can still play Pale Cascade. Please don't have it. I will not hold back. I'll take it. Alright, Hope and Concerted Strike it takes down Lee Sin. Again, a Pell Cascade saves, saves their lease in. Kind of about it. Conflict is all in the mind. We must not relent. So it did draw the guiding touch. Tony's Presser still doing its thing. Strength and grace, beauty in the play. Raise the banner, lift our spirits. We stand strong. But we're kind of forcing them to play yet another gem, which is another two mana that they don't want to be spending this turn. And then I'm attacking for 12. You can kind of barely see her right here. Oh, here we go. So they're not playing the gem, which was the obvious thing. Expected them to have Operation Save Goat. Okay, it's the, the third Guiding Touch. Go. Now we'll be their turn with the attack token, but we are going to rally. So we'll have like one thing to play before we can attack, potentially. The dragon spirit awakens. Force is meaningless without skill. It's problematic. About I, just may have an I think we're good just going wide. And even though Lee Sin gets rid of one of these, we'll still have four attackers. They have two blockers. Our enemies cannot hide. My lad, prepare yourself. Puts me down to five. They can play one more spell. But I don't think I don't think one mana can save save them from this. Their one spell is planning on resonating strike for the Lee Sin. Only that saves them. So there you go, Stony Suppressor did its job. I'll see this through. Really slowed my opponent down. And we're just beating him down with one threes. <laughs> oh well, we can this it could maybe happen. We let's get two Stony Suppressors in play and make their War Mothers cost 14. <laughs> it could happen. Do we just keep all these? Sure. I 
nice to meet you. Uh. I don't like that troll. Dragon blood, Demacian heart. Smashing! I don't like that troll. It's always trolling. What's the fire breath this time? Hmm? A soldier should know to stay out of the way. Always trolling. Many tribes under one banner. My shield is yours. I demand satisfaction. Suffer my fury. Could have done like the Dragon Guard Lieutenant, like Barrier on the Lieutenant to challenge the Hearth Guard. Like originally I was planning on going Barrier on the Lieutenant, you know, challenging the Trundle. But could have done that, but instead I'm just going to get the Barrier on the Shivana so it doesn't take, uh, so it doesn't take damage here and gets 4 out of 12, you know, starts the process of leveling up. Rather that be concerted strike. This matchup we need concerted strike more. Gosh, these things are so big. Too big. I am more than I seem. You are I like that card. anything I've ever seen. I'll stop you. What is this? I got that other hand. Atrocity is going to kill me, and I can't stop that no matter what block I do. Don't let them through. I could go, like, less... Dragon? No. Must end. Witness my true power! Okay, we don't get we don't get the dragon because our thing died. Well, that's unfortunate. I was kind of counting on getting that dragon. I don't know. If, I don't know if I could have done anything differently though. I don't think I could. No, it's not over. Unless this is atrocity, then it's over. Or ruination, it's probably over. Now it is. All right, one on one. All right, going with another big deck. Another deck that's probably pretty good against two mana three twos. We need our Bannermans and our Garens. There's Garen. Cool. I'll keep this. Let's say we need like our Bannermen and our Garens and stuff like that. <laughs> that's a cool emote. Use that one because they're you know an Aurelian Soul deck. And they're also a Shivana deck. See, I got the emos for their deck. Another day guarding the walls. 
pass? No, that hit. Okay, good. All right, that's fine. They can have that card. I don't want them to have Herald of Dragons. You know, they can trade trade two mana cards. It's whatever. Ready weapons. I don't want them to have Herald of Dragons and then start dropping Siobhan at this turn. Another lost. Strike in grace. Beauty in the play. Dragon blood, Damasian heart. End them. End them. Not really. Please no sharp sight. Siobhan's sure. pretty good. I'm one that thinks that Siobhan, Siobhan is underrated. Never keep a dragon waiting. Alright, so we're trading two for two. Um, you know, three and four mana units for us. Four mana unit and two mana spell for them. Not the worst. We do what is right. I think I just got sharp sight. That they're terribly wrong if they think that it's worse than Bulola. We'll take that. Our five mana card and our two mana spell for their five mana card and five mana spell. Shape the skies and mold the earth. We now we do want battle. Eclipse Track. We really want Nightfall. We don't want Daybreak. Daybreak doesn't really matter. We want Nightfall. So that means. I guess. Yes, yeah, so that means we have to like single combat. Ooh, or I could go Flea Feather Tracker now. Go Tracker. And then Eclipse Dragon. Perfect. Love making the Traveler. The Traveler is like, one of the best Celestials. Nothing wrong with Stalking Brood Mother either. And the galaxies listen. Stunned. So obviously I'm gonna try have, try to have concerted strike to take down infinite mind splitter. That is for post block. Yeah. Go for post block. Fury to go up with the Eclipse Dragon, so they play another Mind Splitter. We'll single combat with the Eclipse Dragon. We have it fight Mind Splitter now that's eight power. Uh, they're going for a Brilliant Soul. Puts them down to two. So I was worried. So yeah, I didn't go scout trick. I was worried about them having like with the card with the really and soul being like the thing that obliterates stuff. And so I was worried about like playing the stalking brood mother first, and then they just obliterate stuff, and then I'm in a lot of trouble. But then again, if they do have just obliterate stuff, we're probably in a ton of trouble anyway. TBH. 
I guess if, if that's the case, I could have gone double single combat. So we could go infinite. The fight just isn't the same without you, Anna. I am always here when you need me. Could go infinite. I'm tempted to, to single combat kill Shivana. Before us basically attacking out Justice this next turn. Waits for no one. You're covered. For us open attacking. It honestly may be better to just kill the lieutenant that can... Fight for the oh, really? Oh, that backfired-ish. The lieutenant that could challenge, is what I was going to say. I think we never run out of travelers. Jeez. Never run out of travelers. Karina control. Man, I haven't seen this in a while. I guess they're trying to fight all these uh, discard decks that we've been playing against today uh, with the Karina control. So I wonder if two mana one threes are going to be good against control deck. Let's see. With our two stony suppressors, our egghead researcher making an additional dragon follower for us. I know what lurks in the shadows. Ask me about dragon I just may have an answer. You won't suffer long. Not the right. end. <gasps> no, it's Karina control. It's not BNZ burn. Call in Karina control. Alright, so we'll play Shivana here. But still, see, like that, that two mana, you know, this, this Stony Suppressor is so good. They use a, you know, five mana Thermogenic Beam on it. Honestly, I probably should have passed here, shouldn't I? Instead of just even this attack. That was a quick attack by me. They're passing with 8 mana that's not going to be used. I should just be passing here. Okay. That's not too bad. I'll trade Shivana for a 7 mana spell. Not too bad at all. So a 3-4 currently. If I play Stony Suppressor, should shut off their ability to play another spell. So we'll keep it a 
And then they challenge my Stony Suppressor. Oh, then I don't, I don't, I can't play Sharp Sight and then Bannerman. All right, so never mind. So maybe we just go Garen and just have Sharp Sight available. Sure, they can eat that thing. We'll keep our three mana for our Sharp Sight. No ruination for them. Raise the banner. Lift our spirits. We stand strong. Hold our standard. So yeah, they're gonna go ruination next turn. Yeah, I think they were gonna ruination this turn. I don't really need to cast a sharp side yet. So basically, Sharp Sight would do five damage, right? Like, I could, it'd, it'd be three mana, deal five damage to them. But if their plan is Ruination still, likely plan, wouldn't need to, to play that. All right, I like keeping it there. <laughs> so don't have Ruination mana anymore. Still don't have ruination mana, and then I'm you know I'm playing I'm playing that then researcher then bannerman. <laughs> Cost some nine mana to vengeance. Uh, yeah, this is still more. Let's go. I guess I can't even play Ruination anyway, so maybe I play... Maybe I should be playing, like, Screeching Dragon or Garen there, but... There we go. Stony Suppressor. Keeping them from Ruinationing. Okay, two and two. Let's get that winning record. Oh, no. Frostbite midrange. Frostbite is great against everything. Hmm. While I really like Eclipse Dragon, and these are the two non-Demacia cards in our deck, so if we keep the two, if we keep both Eclipse Dragons, our Bannerman will hit 100%. That's a thing. I don't think we can keep two 7 mana cards, though. We're going to have to ship one back. No, we haven't done any Catastrophe decks recently for Meme Monday. Pass. No Woman Hawk. Yeah. Um... We did have a really cool, like we did, the last time we played like uh, Spooky Karma, <laughs> we were, we did get the, Victory requires um, a sharp blade. I'm something of with Spooky Karma, we did get uh, glory, a double catastrophe with a leveled up Karma. So that was really cool. So that's something that happened recently in life. We got some three drops. We got some three drops in here. A chill in the air. Why you do this? The less we fear. I'll follow where I can. Stay back. Stay resolute. All right, so I know that's not really a very good trade for me with Bannerman, but TBH, I didn't think they were going to block. So I thought that I thought that we had. Free attack there. The trap is set. Got your back. I'll cut them apart. Face me. Remember me. I already forgot. I don't even remember your name. Who are you again? Hooray! We didn't miss. There's only one card out of the 31. It's a miss. Show them our metal. Might as well attack. Tread carefully. Our banner. 
So they about to have some one mana five fives. Nothing escapes my watch. I don't like that. I wanna have my fight spells. Slash stony suppressor. You own what you take. Sure. You wanna kill a two four? Go right ahead. Doing good card wise because of those egghead researchers. The dragon's rage claws to get out. I'm keeping the stony suppressor to help with Eclipse Dragon. Only the finest serve. Leh. I don't think they'll have three mana frost Look out card. Sweet. So I was thinking of keeping Stony Suppressor to help turn on Eclipse Dragon, but I'm over it. I'm just gonna play it. Few earn the right to call themselves Trifarian. Who are you targeting? And why can't I tell who you're targeting? Okay, I can I can go on them. Alright, so yeah, it's it's those two. I smell fear. Sejuani's Fury of the North. Alright, so both of their things are will be stunned. And then all the rest of these are surviving, so we'll be able to go immediately to attacks. Force them to cast some expensive Frostbite cards. Pretty cool. See, expensive frostbite card. All right, down to seven. Yep, I don't have the mana to do all this stuff. Well, this is only five damage anyway. Envyola's Vox is so good. <laughs> so like our our egghead researcher created an Enviola's Vox, which then created an infinite mind splitter and another infinite mind splitter. <laughs> it's just awesome. I'm planning on it. We're gonna keep this birdie stunned. All right, that'll do it. Triple mind splitter. Burn all in dragon fire. GGs. All right, so that's Stony Shivana. Yeah, another three two. So yeah, all four decks today with the winning record. That's a good rank up day, for sure. Um, this one was pretty awesome. I liked it quite a bit. Yeah, like the uh, the um, everything did well in here. The egghead researcher was really cool at that last game, creating the Enviolus Vox, which Enviolus Vox started creating infinite mind splitters. That was pretty awesome. Um, and uh, yeah, like the sharp sights were really good for us with that pump spell. Dragon Guard Lieutenant being a challenger. Stony Suppressor though, that was <laughs> did some good stuff. Did really did great against the Lee Sin deck and the Karina Control deck. Our first two wins. Stony Suppressor was pretty big in those. Um, you know, Bannerman, of course, amazing. So yeah, the deck, the deck played out pretty well, have to say. I enjoyed it. Yeah, we won against Frostbite. <laughs> that doesn't, that's not easy. Um, 
All right, so that's Stony Shivana, though. Those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. And of course, feel free to leave those comments. I always love seeing those comments. Let me know what you think of the deck. If you're trying it out yourself, um, how's it going for you? Any, anything else? Any questions you have about the deck, about sequencing, anything, you know, always uh, leave those comments. But anyway, thank you so much for watching some Stony Shivana, and I'll see you for the next video.